Welcome to DefExpo 2016. Over three decades, India and Israel have established strong and prosperous cooperation in commercial, scientific, cultural, defense and security. The recent DefExpo 2016 exhibition in Goa provided a unique view of some of the highlights of this cooperation. Twenty-eight Israeli defense industries are here at DefExpo in the Israeli pavilion, small, medium and large companies showing the best of systems and technologies Israel can offer. Israel's national pavilion was one of the largest at DefExpo. Many Israeli systems were also displayed by Indian partners, highlighting the extensive cooperation between the two countries. Among such systems were the MR SAM launch vehicle developed by the DRDO in cooperation with IAI. Elbit Systems Hermes 450 and Hermes 900 UAVs to be produced in India by Alpha Design and LR SAM and Spike missiles designed by Rafael to be manufactured in India by Barrett Dynamics. Among the applications of IAI's radars on display were threat warning and ground surveillance systems as well as SIMS, an integrated radar and electro-optical sensor designed to detect IEDs. Another radar is the NavGuard, used to protect boats from missiles fired offshore. The core of Israel's thermal imaging systems are those thermal imaging cameras developed by SCD. The company unveiled at DefExpo new high-resolution cameras, called uncooled systems for low, mid and short wave systems. These thermal imaging systems are designed for various applications, such as sensors for warning systems, surveillance, reconnaissance and targeting. Each requires unique optical assemblies, lenses and coatings to meet specific applications. Such systems were introduced at the exhibition by specialists such as Ophir Optronics and RP Optical Lab. Another specialist taking part at DefExpo is Nanomotion, providing micro-electro-mechanical systems using piezoelectric drive systems. Among the applications displayed were shutter, rotating mirror and complete micro-stabilized EO payload weighing 180 grams. As one of Israel's leaders in EO technology, Opgal introduced complete EO systems designed for specific applications, from perimeter and homeland security to integrated multi-sensor systems for remotely controlled weapon systems. Controp also displayed several electro-optical systems, such as these stamp mini payloads. Another application of Israel's EO technology is the music from Elbit Systems, using a laser-directed infrared countermeasures DIRCAM to protect fixed-wing and rotary-wing platforms from heat-seeking missiles. Focused on land-based security, Magal displayed a linear sensor based on optical fiber sensor technology. Applied on a sense or buried along pipelines, the sensor monitors and secures infrastructure lines and perimeters of strategic sites. Weapon systems displayed here by Elbit Systems included the Cardon, computer-controlled mortar system mounted on a rotating pedestal that enabled the installation of such mortar on light vehicles such as armored personnel carriers and trucks. The company also provides various upgrades for combat vehicles. Such upgrades feature improvements of EO systems, including gunner and independent commander sites, ballistic computers, fire control, integration of missile controls, etc. Modernization programs often include an integrated air conditioning and auxiliary power that also provides CBRN filtering, also offered by Elbit Systems and Betel Industries. PLASAN, Israel's specialist of vehicle protection, outlined combat-proven protection systems for light and medium combat vehicles, including wheeled, tracked and amphibious platforms. Such upgrades often require the integration of a new power pack. Re-engining of combat systems is the forte of Nimda Diesel Group, that displayed here its field-proven modernization solutions for T-72 and BMP-2. Other companies outlined specific logistical solutions for armored vehicles. CI featured fast and accurate bore sighting for various weapon systems. Urdan Industries unveiled the Back Trail, a heavy trailer enabling units of tanks, APCs and SP guns to safely carry loads of ammunition, fuels or explosives. Astronautics unveiled an integrated command and control system developed for the Artillery Corps. 
The system comprises specific modules for target acquisition and forward controllers, battery level and individual gun. It is designed to support the artillery operations either individually or as part of comprehensive battle management systems. Among the robotic systems is the Probot from Roboteam an unmanned wheeled robot that can carry loads to support an infantry squad. It is controlled by standard robotic controllers or a new smart stick, enabling a single soldier to command the robot with minimal training. The X-95 assault weapon, Dan.338 sniper rifle and Negev-7 light machine gun were some of the weapons on display at Israel Weapon Industries IWI. The weapons were equipped with accessories and sights from Meprolite. Unique sensors that can see through walls were displayed by Camaro. The handheld sensor can indicate the presence of human beings in a closed enclosure behind the wall. The Xava 400 can also map the number and positions of multiple persons or objects in the room. Life-saving innovations for military, law enforcement and emergency response displayed by Persis Medical include this thermal blanket that prevents hypothermia and NIO, providing safe and quick vascular access even in emergency. Noga Einat, Israel's leading provider of combat boots, has outsourced the production to India. Today, the company is expanding its reach and is offering the product supplied to the IDF to equip the Indian military forces. Rafael displayed several missile systems families that included Derby Mark III and Python V. Both were developed as air-to-air -air weapons but are also used in the surface-to-air role. Rafael's Spike multi-purpose missiles were also displayed here, integrated on the armored, remotely controlled unmanned turret Samson 30, mounting a 30mm automatic cannon and two Spike missiles. Rafael unveiled here several layers of its shipborne defense systems, including the new Sea Dome, based on the combat-proven Iron Dome. The company also offers a soft protection layer, utilizing decoys and the Sea Gem, an expendable electronic countermeasure. Another expert in electronic combat, More Technologies, outlined other solutions for electronic warfare. Supporting technologies on display included Orbit unveiled the Airtrack 60, airborne satellite communications terminal designed for manned and unmanned platforms. Enercon Technologies. Technologies displayed custom-built power supplies designed for missiles, UAVs, etc. Modern defense systems are dependent on high-accuracy location measurement provided by Al Cielo. The company offers various systems based on fiber-optical gyro FOG technology supporting different levels of precision to meet specific application. PCB Technologies displayed complex printed circuit boards designed for today's systems, including rigid flexible, high-density, multi-layered PCBs. Aero Maoz is responsible for the interfaces connecting between users and machines, panels, keypads and joysticks. Thank you for watching. More videos are available at defenseupdate.com.